Friends, we continue to storm the frozen cellars. We took the rollers in order to break into this underground tunnel. This is for moving fast. If there is ice, then we have skates. And the ice will be there. I am ready. The most convenient way to force the cellars of Chernobyl. Harder than it looks. Do you like it? I think these are women's skates. I knew it. Why? Because I feel it. Are you uncomfortable? Wait for Camrad. The last time I skated was 20 years ago. But I already have advice for those who are going to do it. Lace them up so that it almost hurts. The right roller is too tight. Pity of it. Maybe we can try to fix it? This one. Camrad, let's go. This roller is too tight. Don't cheat. Did you say your skates are for women? Yes, I was framed. Camrad, let's dive right into the hole under the water. Seuss, look how good you skate. You are very good at it. Wow. Guys, appreciate how magical. Crystal clear bottom. I haven't skated in a long time. Very beautiful. Further will be even better. Bono, tell me, what can you say about what's going on? Do you think this is normal? It's a difficult question. I think skates are good for ice skating, but roller skates, probably not. Crawl inside. I won't get through here. I will help you. Come on, go. We asked the maestro on stage. Stop falling. <laughs> the skates are not sharpened. Why didn't anyone sharpen them? Guys, this is really scary. Look, completely transparent ice below us. It's scary because I don't know how thick the ice is and whether it can crack. But if one of us fails, then most likely it will not be possible to save him. Oh my gosh. What it is? Am I the only one who sees it? What are you doing here? Friends, look what lies at the bottom. Look what's in there. There's a lot. There is a welding rectifier, and a cable, and some nuts. They must have dismantled something. Wow, look how unusual this gap looks. So deep, but still not reaching the water. Do you think it's the thickness of the ice, or is the ice even thicker? Interesting bottom, topography, like a bend. Seuss, do you and Camrad still want to go skating here? Do you like it? But watch out. I'm just afraid that further the ice will be thin. See what I came up with. The ice is cracking. Are you kidding? No. Bono, I forgot what to do in such cases. Now I'll see what's there. Be careful. Please. Both of you will fail. Stop, don't do this. Everything will be okay. Don't go, don't. You will fail now. Everything is fine. Here it crackles. Guys, look what a pipe sticking out from under the water looks like. It froze. The ice is cracking where I've just been. I have heard. Already cracking? Yes. Camrad, carefully, it's already very dangerous there. Did it really crack, or are you joking? Do I look like a joker? This sound was not made by the ice, but by the cable. Look at him. Looks like he's breaking everything. But if Camrad goes under the ice, who is going to save him? Bono, will you run after him? We will pull it with a wire. It hardly works. Camrad, what are you doing? What's going on? It seems he can't get out. More like an epileptic attack, but nothing can help here. We just need to wait. The main thing is that the ice endures. Honey, I'll save you. Go here. Many people think and write in the comments that Camrad is just a fool. But this is not so. He just has epilepsy. This is a serious disease. He's not like that because he wants to stand out or fool around. Because sometimes he has seizures. It remains only to understand and sympathize with her. Bono, help! Do you hear sounds? It's Camrad. Sasha, grab Bono. Pull. Come on, help them. Pull them out. Grab the cable. Why did you draw me to you? Enough. Everything is fine. Let's move on. Sure. Yes. It's up to you. I don't know how to judge the strength of the ice. I'll check. It's all right there. Check carefully. It just cracks sometimes. All right, let's go ahead. Be careful. Don't rush. Everything is okay there. Further, the ice changes shape. Bono. 
Please be very careful. Look out. Quiet. Ice is strong. Look, there are pipes here too. Is it visually clear if the ice is getting thinner? Just a little bit. And here it is even thinner. Then don't go any further. Oh no. No, so far so good. Here too, more than two inches. How did he determine those two inches? Oh, there is a living spider. Guys, look, a spider. Yes, alive and crawling. He's running on ice. Guys, even I'm scared to go out there. Scared to crawl out there. Why so? I am very afraid of ice. I think about the cold and understand how terrible it is. In that case, let's use the boat. An inflatable boat. Friends, just look at this. This is what an ideal Chernobyl radioactive bottom looks like. And here's another crack. Let's go find a flashlight. The flashlight is where Bono is now. I'll check. Look, the exit is up. We can get out. Help me find a flashlight. There is an opportunity to look around. Dima. What? Come to us. It's all right, I promise. It would be nice to make a hole around here and launch a drone. The stick froze. Look. No, it was some kind of Soviet pump. Some kind of unit was controlled by this stick. When you move your feet so loudly, the whole ice is shaking. I found your flashlight. Are you serious? Did you manage to find him? Camrad, here is Creason's lantern. The lens has gone so far. Spectators, do you remember the last time we threw this lantern off the boat? Will we get it? There is a lantern here. A little further is the ring from it, and here is the lens. See how far it flew? Yeah. You pushed him so hard that he fell apart, but he still blinked for a very long time. Yes. Yeah, Sasha. I am the fish of your dreams. Camrad has gone crazy. Camrad, how do you like it? Friends, we are under the reactor. We are skating. We're losing our heads. It's such a pleasure. I don't get such pleasure even from Creason with his videos. I'd rather move away because he's going crazy. Guys, when Camrad goes crazy, it becomes dangerous around. Bono, how are we doing? We found another staircase. Is there a descent to the lower floor? There is, but it is also flooded and frozen. What are our plans? We want to fly the drone to the floor below. Yes, we need to punch a hole and swim under the transparent ice. Then let's go punch. Let's. But first. What? There is a descent down here. Let's go look at it. Oh, there it is. Same thing, right? Look, guys, everything is the same. Only no one made holes here. Yes, the stairs go down, there is another floor. Imagine, this is not a legend, it's a huge floor. On the other side, we found another descent to that huge flooded floor. Shall we go further down the corridor today? I would like to, but it's too scary. Everything will be okay. So far, I'm pleasantly surprised by how strong the ice is until you fall under it. Now we will launch the drone and move deeper into the basement. See this branched system? In this direction there is a corridor, to the right there is another. They can be explored for a very long time. We need to be careful here, because we have moved further, and in this place the ice can be thinner. Where does this sound come from? Did you hear any sound? No, everything is fine. How do you like the ice? Strong. Do you see the pin in front of you? No, right in front of you. A pin in the center of the tunnel. Yeah. We sailed to this place last time. I will go with you. The ice does not crack surprisingly. Something like glass will underwater. Guys, this is really scary. I'm afraid to imagine what will happen if one of us goes under the ice. I have a completely transparent surface under my feet, so I cannot determine the thickness of the ice. Psychologically, this is a very stressful moment, at least for me. 
You seem to be floating in the air. Yes, and I feel the same way. It looks so unusual. In fact, there is quite a lot of depth here. Bono. It is better not to go here. There is already thin ice. Really? Then I won't go. Bono, don't go any further. Even from here, I can see that it is thin. Visually, the ice layer seems to be decreasing. There is a tunnel further on. No, there are tunnels on the right and left. Seuss used to go there. Bono, maybe. Get back, fast. Come to us. What happened? The ice is cracked. Horror. That's about the thickness of the ice there. There really is a crack. You crawled out of there so quickly. Well done. Did you see that? I saw it, and I'm shocked. Bono, you got your bearings very quickly. I wonder where this tunnel leads further. It's some kind of closed room. Sus went there with chemical protection, and there are more tunnels. The ice is getting thinner, which means there is no exit to the street. Yes, I think there is something closed. Something like a bunker, maybe? In theory, we can get there in an inflatable boat, am I right? Yes, but it's risky, because the boat can break on the cracked ice. Have you already had this in the Stalinist tunnel? What if we use thin boats? Yes, I think it can swim. Seuss. Huh? Bono nearly fell through the ice. Where? Where the pin is. The ice is very thin there. Bono, I told you to obey your mom and dad. Why did you go ahead? Only people on skates should have been allowed in there. Will we inflate boats? We can inflate, but it's very scary there. The ice will cut it. How will it cut it? Sooner or later the ice will break, and we have a very cheap boat. But the area of pressure on the ice will be larger. Sasha, let's cut a hole right here, where the ice is transparent. The vibration on the ice, guys, is very strong. Cracks will start to appear soon, I can feel it. Can you imagine what will happen if all the ice cracks and the water rises? We'll have to run away. The exit is near. Now, cracks will appear. Here, look. I do not understand what is going on. Oh, it's double layered. The cracks are showing. Let's call 911 of the city of Pripyat now. Let's tell them, rescue service, we have a man under the ice. Sasha, the hole is ready, bring the copter. Did you get scared when the ice started to crack? Just a little. It was obvious that the ice would crack sooner or later. With each step, his layer became thinner and thinner. I think that this is where the tunnel is located, which leads towards the operating fourth reactor. The further you go, the warmer the water becomes, and the ice becomes thinner accordingly. There is no exit to the street and communication is quite large. In any case, we need to return there by boats when the ice melts. Now the risk of piercing the boat and sinking to the bottom is too great. Let's build a plan of action after the launch of the drone. The drone is almost ready, it remains only to untangle this strange wire. Guys, something happened that we did not expect. After the last start, the motors were frozen because there was water left in them. Outside, we cleaned them, but the magnets and the winding inside are also in ice. Because of this, we cannot rotate them. Because the motors are jammed, we can't start the copter. But the guys have some idea. Maybe pee in it. Let's try the three of us one by one. I can take over this engine. First I'll try to lower it into the hole. Guys, do you think the ice will melt underwater? But you can try. It doesn't sink. The ice began to freeze again. Friends, look how the bubbles float under the ice. We solved the problem with the copter. The water helped him, we didn't have to pee. He takes amazing pictures. Watch how he spins. Let me turn it around and take a picture of you. Did you film it? Look what a fish. Like a little dog. Look what's there. Do you see it? Yeah. What's this? There is some kind of building structure. Yes, I think so too. I'll move closer. See if there is a descent to the lower tier. Floats well. Like a submarine. Look at it. If only it didn't get stuck. Don't worry, it's alright. It's already hooked. Pick up the wire. 
doesn't move. Sasha, lift it as high as possible to check the thickness of the ice. Okay, now I'll raise it up. Look, can you see the thickness? Dima, can you see? Thickness is about 3 to 6 inches. Finally, they are easy to manage. The motors have thawed. A little higher, no need to raise dust. It looks like a stingray. How cool to see it. With such visibility to manage it a pleasure. Like a little sea dog. Look, I press the gas with all my might. Now that's speed. Then, we go under the stairs. Let's go. Guys, we managed to unfreeze the motors. Here we tested the copter, everything works fine. So we will lower it under the stairs. Without GoPro, it is not buggy, it turns around easily, dives very quickly. Now we will load it into the completely flooded minus the first floor, and see what is there. Hope it gets through. Carefully. Done. Here it is, the fish. Let's go quickly. We need to launch to the lower tier. And we'll think about it. Maybe we'll inflate the boats and sail. Guys, we reached the same parallel staircase that leads to that terrible floor. Now we will punch a hole and launch the drone, but this time correctly so that the wire does not get tangled, and we'll swim to those secret rooms. Look, the handrails continue from below under the water. We need to make a hole in the ice right there. As close as possible. Here. Guys, we're moving forward. We must find a passage to the fourth power unit. That secret one. Yes, we need to swim there. I think that our rope should be enough to swim to some technical hatch, and then we will swim out. Hold done. Swim. Now the main thing is to swim carefully. You're right above the railing now. It floats there, to the left. No, swim back. Now, straight ahead and down. Now I saw the need to go down. Yes, right. Oh my gosh. I see a door there and wires on it. Come inside. Oh, I got caught on the stairs. What a shame. I'm dropping. I can hear it buzzing underwater. Here is the door. I'm right over it. Is this a hermetic door? Yes, a huge hermetic door. Let's look around. There is some room there. Now I'm going to raise the camera, see? And now below. Here, come straight ahead. It's dark. Is something wrong? The signal disappeared, but now everything is fine. Oh, bottom. It's hard to manage. We had to pee on it. Maybe. Maybe the motor is frozen? We need to understand if there is a hermetic door further, and then make a decision. The main thing is to have a passage. I restarted it. Move on. Carefully, there may be dead. It doesn't move, it needs a wire. No, the drone itself pulls it. For some reason it's very buggy. You see? Of course. It's radiation. It must be strong. It's twitching. Are these paintings on the wall? From where? A turtle and a whale. What is it all about? Looks like some sort of turtle. By the way, we did not take into account that when the reactor was extinguished, the radiation disabled the electronics. Here is the door. Oh, it turned off, but I already restarted it. It immediately pops up. Yeah. I immersed it a bit, and look further. There is a void. Yes, behind the airlock. Swimming into the void. Oh my gosh, see what's next. Move forward. Corridor. Come on. Here, the airlock, look. Where? On the right. Here. No, not there. On the other side. Here. No, it twitches. I leveled. To this side. Here, the door is open. Straight. Here, look at this. Give it a wire, it needs. Here's the door, see? I see, but it doesn't swim. Here is the open door, look. Oh, it floated. What's this? I told you, the door. Okay. Still further. And what's that? Cable racks. Ah, the cable duct. Exactly, that's it. Swim further. It's a huge space. Sasha, what do you see there? Oh, light bulb. It's a nightmare here. Something is holding the copter. I can't move on. I gas with all my might. Here, the lamp is in front of us. I need to pull a little to make it float. It clings. Come on. I'll submerge it a little deeper and try to gas. It is buzzing. Yeah. So, we sailed through the light bulb. It got stuck on something. I'm trying to equalize. 
but it still does not obey. By the way, the depth is now 2.8 yards. Shall we go back and see if there's another floor there? Have you already swum? Let's check if there is a minus second. Look at the ceiling. Look what's here. Let me turn it around a bit. This is how it looks from above. Now we should see it wire. Yes, here is the wire. Sasha, swim on. Try further. Yes. Down the tunnel. Yes. It makes no sense. Let's see if there are stairs. Let's look down. Let's. I can't see anything there due to the depth. Swim there a bit. Maybe we can find artifacts. Here, the bottom is clearly visible. There is something radioactive. Yes, exactly. Cool. Oh, look. Wow. Guys, what is this? Elephant's leg. Blimey. It turns out that the elephant's leg is flooded? Careful, Sasha. Can get caught. We'll take the drone out, and it'll be in radiation. We'll have to return it under warranty. Under warranty? Do you think it'll be accepted under warranty after that? There's a ladder lying around, you see? Yes, even lower. Where did we go? Where did the leg go? The leg is here, under you. Why aren't there fish? Imagine scuba diving there. You can get stuck and die. <laughs> Let's now try to see what is at the top. Most interesting death. Die under a nuclear reactor, right? The wire from the drone is not tangled, so we continue. Let's check the stairs to see if there's another floor. Pull out. Decided to pull it out by hand. Everything goes well. Don't rush, be careful. Yes, so that the wire does not get tangled. If it gets stuck, then we will lose all frames. Then Camrad will have to dive. Let's take it down to lower level. Now it should stabilize. Now I can step on the gas. It's much easier to manage now. Bubbles under the ice. Very cool. I control it. Go ahead. Give it the wire. I'll lower it to the bottom. I have given. Fine. There is some kind of staircase. Now let's explore it. Wow. There again. Look. There's another entrance. Try to swim. What? Give me a sec. One more door. Yes. What's this? Done, I'm in. I do not know either. Some iron doors. A structure to which they were welded with iron posts. Turn around, take it back. Look what is there. There's a railing and then there's a staircase. Swim in this hole. Now I'm going a little further. Do you see the stairs? Well, this is the end. It caught onto the railing. Did the footage remain on the drone? We can download them. As long as there is a connection with him, I can download. Download quickly. You see, even if the ice melts, the only way to get it is for a scuba diver to dive in there and untangle that wire. Because it got tangled at a depth of almost 5 yards. Can you imagine? $5,000 went to the bottom of Chernobyl. I'll try to get it. The last attempt, the water is already muddy. Look, I can still manage it. Last minutes. Oh, we weren't here. Certainly. Let me try to get up. Where? He went up. Really floats up. And stopped again. Better pull down. So it got stuck down. What a beast. Does the wire suck? Quite a bit. Now I see that the wire goes under the railing, and then nothing is visible. He's stuck somewhere, now twitching helplessly. In general, there is a railing somewhere, and it caught onto them. Maybe try moving the wire away from the railing? Hush, it's humming. Is it the end of it? Camrad, who will pay? Yes, Camrad. Someone other than me. At what depth is it now? Depth 4.1 yards. 4.1. Yes. And it was almost 5. Above, swim even higher. Here I see it. Ah, so now to the right. I can't sail away, something is holding it. No, the wire is completely free. Oh no, not here. Just don't tie it in a loop. Try to gently pull the wire, but very slowly. Let's see what happens. It's getting closer, I can see. Now I'll turn a little to the left. Closer and closer, more to the left. Closer and closer. Closer and closer. Twitched. They told you to pull slowly. Pull again. Just slow. Got caught? Yes. So it's somewhere in the back. Then you need to turn around. Here, the wire is right above us. Most likely, it is somewhere in this stick. Try pulling. Wait, is this our light? Yes, it's ours. It is very close. It got closer. I can see it from here. See? The charge remains 6%. How much? Yes, so few. Come on, our friend. I see it. It has become much closer. Pull out. I can't. It's stuck. Bring a stick. 
Watch how he twitches. Yes, he's stuck between the stairs, so I just need to go there. Let go for now, I'll try to sail away. Last try, only 4% left. Someone can take off their clothes and dive in after it. Look, this stick will do. It's shorter than it should be, but let's try. Let me look for a longer. Look, it has a hook on it too. Sasha, try moving it. Now forward. I'm moving. By the way, the wire has become longer. Yes. So try little by little. It gets closer. There it is. Very close, but not reachable. Come on, 1%. Don't scratch it, we can't return it under warranty. Oh, it's very close. Yes, Sasha, come on, on the last breath. Bono, save us, please. The end, it was discharged. It's a pity. Here, I see it, it turned off. Is the battery dead? Yes, it has discharged. Can you see what it's stuck to? Is it far away? There are many loops. Bono, watch your hands. I can't figure out which side it is, maybe here. I see it. It seems to be dancing. Now very close. How did you do it? He got it. We won. The copter works. It's not dead. How did we do it? It was very hard. He swam at great depths. Bono, have you wet your hands? Put on mittens. I have my spares. Bono once again saved us all. Hero. Let's leave quickly because Cambert wants tea again. Camrad, you're not the only one who wants this. I need it too. Does anyone want to offer me? Bono promised us to brew his pure again. Guys, we managed to explore this minus the first floor. There are a lot of tunnels. We were afraid that the copter would get confused, but we managed to swim far. There were hermetic doors and a strange light. So we decided to rent scuba gear. And on a rented scuba gear, we will calmly swim there. But it will be in the summer, because scuba diving under the ice is deadly. Sasha, in autumn. We leave here and take all the rubbish with us. It's clean, here we left only food for the next time. Anything can happen, we might get stuck here. So we are clean, before the law, we didn't even litter here. We didn't break anything. We took away even small bags. We've taken every little detail. Friends, thank you for being with us. We don't want to delay you, so see you in the new episodes.